Welcome to the Cox Business Video Library. My name is Dean and I'm one of several customer education specialists supporting you in your IP-centric service across the nation. Now I will be covering how to utilize your phone directory on your phone in order to save people, to do quick dial, uh, to have your own personal directory on your IP-centric phone. It's a pretty simple process. It's, it's, the process is sort of old school, like using your old cell phones when you had to use the keys to enter somebody's name. Uh, it'll, I'll walk you through that process and you'll see it'd be fairly easy. In a previous video, I showed you how to utilize your call history to save it to your directory, which is the easiest process. In this video, I'm going to show you the more manual process to enter something into your phone directory. So let's go ahead and begin. In this section, what I'm going to do is show you on your LCD screen, one of the first options in there is your DIR, or I'll go ahead and put that in light status, but DIR, which is your directory. What I'm going to simply do is hit that soft key to activate my directory. Right now, my options are new personal directory, search my personal directory, or anything below that is actually the, the people that I've saved previously in my directory. I'm going to go ahead and set one up from scratch. So I'm going to scroll back up to New Personal Directory. I'm going to hit the Add key. And now it's asking me for a name. So I'm going to go ahead and type in a name. I think what I will do is I'll hit this key, and the name I'm going to spell out is going to be Frank. I don't really know a Frank, but I'm just going to go ahead and put in Frank. So I hit the key until I get the letters that I need. So I've got Frank in there. The next thing I'm going to do is I'm going to scroll down to the number. If it's a long distance number, I need to put the one in ahead of it, plus the area code and the phone number. Local number doesn't need it. If it's an extension within the business, you can just put in the four digit extension. So I'm going to go ahead and put in a phone number. And then what I can do is scroll down to the ringtone. I can create a specialized ringtone for this particular person. So when they call me, I know it's them calling. So I've scrolled down to ring. I'm going to click option. And then it defaults to the very bottom one. I'm going to scroll up to see what I like in my ringtones for them. And if I want to play it, I can play it. After I find something that I like, I'll hit select. And it takes me back to my directory at this point. So now I've got the name, I've got the phone number, and I've got my ringtone. What do you think I do next? That's right, I simply save. I hit the save button, and now that is in my directory. If I need to find them, I'll go back to default status. I go into my directory and then I can actually search for them or I can scroll down until I find them and if I want to place a call to them I hit the dial button and away I go. The call is made, I can pick up my handset or I can just keep it on speakerphone if I choose to. That's how you do it and thank you for your time and enjoy using your directory.